Yo, yo, yo. What's up, guys? Jesse Rush with Fling Got Bows here. And uh, today I'm going to talk to you about something new. I need to do this to all my bows anyway. Um, it's going to help you shoot a lot straighter. Okay, it's, it's, it's putting a knock anchor point on your string. And you don't just want to eyeball this and do it, you know, put it anywhere wherever. You know what I mean? You want to put it proper. So here's my arrow rest. This is my U English longbow. Okay? And, uh... It's not a real string, it's a um, paracord, but I do some special things, um, and I use bone tip overlays for my knocks on my English longbow, and on my uh, American, quote unquote American longbow, but either way, so here's what you do, alright, you take your arrow, before, before your, uh, before your uh, knocking string is on there, it's just regular sewing thread. So say that white stuff is not there, okay? What you're gonna do is you're gonna take your arrow, put it on where you think it's eyeballed perfectly straight, and then take a speed square. And what I do is I get my bow lined up, the string, I get it lined up with the edge of this table, because this table has a little lip on it. If you look from the top, when I get it perfectly lined up, yeah, let's see, that side perfect, and I mean it's, you've got to try to get it exactly perfect. The reason I lined up with the table is because the string can move. But once I get this guy lined up with the table, it doesn't move. Alright, so next what you do is you gotta have the arrow on there because you want to put your knocking point above the arrow. So you basically slide this up tight. Make sure it's flat on the string, which is lined up all the way down the table on that lip, you take a speed square, which is seven inches, so at brace height, this should work, six and a half inch brace height, so line it up, and put it on the, this side of your arrow, which would be the top side, make sure it's touching the arrow, and then that will give you a perfectly straight knocking point. Now you just take the speed, you know, make sure your arrow is right up against the speed square at a straight angle. Then you can just take the speed square off and start putting your knocking point string on your bow string. And uh, I just do one on the top, that way I can just click it on down here and slide it up to the string. But some people do put another one right here so that there's like, you know, you put it in between the two strings and you're good. Um, some people do that. I don't bother with it. But anyway, there's been your... Uh, Archery tip of the day. This is Jesse Rush from Flingot Bows. Take it easy.